Now at noon, a big cleanup for several businesses in West LA after a pair of burglars smashed their way in and made off with cash. Five restaurants were targeted by the thieves overnight and residents say they are fed up with the increasing crime. KTLA 5's Gene Kang is live in West LA with more on this. Gene. Hi, Glenn and Lou. These family owned restaurants say they are frustrated and scared. As you see, the front doors are boarded up. That's after two men are accused of hopping over their front patio and smashing their front window, taking some cash. Let's take a look at this new surveillance video. This video shows a man in a dark hoodie smash the front door of Laziz Grill here in West LA with some kind of tool shattering instantly. He walks in the Persian restaurant around 2.30 a.m. to the cash register. The owner says he stole a couple hundred dollars, but that's not all. Police say two masked men broke into five restaurants, as you mentioned earlier, in the West LA area. The first three locations are Laziz Grill, Mashti Malone's Ice Cream, and the Room Sushi Bar by Westwood Boulevard and Missouri Avenue. The other two are just down the street at Olympic in Sepulveda. The property owner says the thieves got away with a safe and some cash, but it's unclear exactly how much money they got away with. These family-owned businesses say they're upset it's the first time for the Persian restaurant, while the sushi restaurant says they've fell victim multiple times. It's so sad. It's, honestly, I'm, I'm very scared. It's here and some people come and do it like this. Um, it's so sad. It's been happened to me like five times. Yes, and then it seemed like police cannot do anything. The police came every time, but this, this time today, no. I don't know why. Take a look at this. Another angle shows the man with a red bandana covering part of his face. You can see his profile as he jumps back over the front patio holding a tip jar and cash from Lizzie's Grill. Meantime, LAPD says the two men are part of a larger group that are most likely responsible for a string of smash and grabs in this area, which is an ongoing problem, according to business owners and residents here in West LA. Now back out here live, coming up next, we have new surveillance video of the possible getaway SUV that pulled up right after those smash and grabs. We have more on that coming up in the next hour, but there's a lot of growing frustration. Reporting live here in West LA, Gene Kang, back to in the studio.